Welcome back to Kaya. Let's explore. Let's have a snowball fight. Tap to throw snowballs at Trini and Tui. And watch out! where Connie lives. Connie's great at building and fixing things. It doesn't look like she's home, though. This is the greenhouse, where we grow vegetables and other plants. Nobody's in there now. Hi, Molly. Hi, Dad. Can you pick me some fresh blueberries so I can make some more blueberry jam? I'd love to help. Anabasi! Thanks, Molly. Hi, Mal. Hi, Mom. I'd love some more agate stones. Can you find any more at the river? Yeah, I'm on it. Masi, ciao. Thanks, Molly. Collect agate stones for Mom. Pick blueberries for Dad. Let's collect some agate stones to bring to Mom. Oh. 
well done! Here in Alaska, we only take what we need. And we've got five beautiful agate stones. Let's bring the agate stones to Mom. I'll add them to my backpack. Let's pick blueberries so Dad can make blueberry jam. All done! Here in Alaska, we only take what we need, and we've got a full basket. Let's bring the blueberries to Dad. I'll add them to my backpack. Deliver the blueberries to Dad. Deliver the agate stones to Mom. How's it going, Ma? Hi, Mom. Did you find any agate stones? Yep, they're in my backpack. Let's get them from my backpack. Wow, thanks for the agates, Molly. I'll polish these up so we can sell them at the trading post. Hi, Molly. Hi, Dad. Did you find any blueberries? Yep, they're in my backpack. Let's get them from my backpack. Anna Bassi, thanks for the blueberries, Ma. Now I can make blueberry jam. Hey there, Molly. How's it going? Hey, Trini. That snowball fight was fun. Want to have another? Meet me and Tui at the snow fort. Totally. Snowball fights are so much fun. Tui, want to have another snowball fight? Meet me and Trini at the snow fort. That sounds awesome. See you there. Let's collect sap to bring to Auntie Midge so she can make her syrup. First, throw a hole in the tree. Next, put the spile, a small tube, into the tree. This is how the sap will flow out. Then, pound the spile in to get it just deep enough to stay in place. Now, hang the bucket to collect the sap. All done! Here in Alaska, we only take what we need. And we've got a full bucket. Let's bring the sap to Auntie Midge. I'll add it to my backpack. Bring the ball to the basketball hoop at school. Deliver the sap to Auntie Midge. Tap the basketball to shoot it into the hoop. Woohoo! Great job! Woohoo! Yeah! Great job! Job. Yeah. Woohoo. Woohoo.
How's it going, Molly? Hi, Auntie Midge. Did you find any sap for me? Yep, it's in my backpack. Let's get it from my backpack. Thanks, Molly. This sap will make delicious syrup we can have with pancakes. Let's pick blueberries so Dad can make blueberry jam. Masi cho blueberries. That means thank you in the Gwich in language. Here in Alaska, we always say thank you to nature. Let's bring the blueberries to Dad. I'll add them to my backpack. How's it going, Molly? Hi, Auntie Midge. More people are asking for my famous syrup. Can you collect more sap for me? Sure thing. Mustn't cho. Thanks, Molly. Collect birch tree sap for Auntie Midge. Let's collect some agate stones to bring to Mom. Agates? That means thank you in the Gwich In language. Here in Alaska, we always say thank you to nature. Let's bring the agate stones to Mom. I'll add them to my backpack. Collect sap to bring to Auntie Midge so she can make her syrup. First, drill a hole in the tree. Next, put the spile, a small tube, into the tree. This is how the sap will flow out. Then, pound the spile in to get it just deep enough to stay in place. Now, hang the bucket to collect the sap. Masi cho, birch trees. That means thank you in the Gwich In language. Here in Alaska, we always say thank you to nature. Let's bring the sap to Auntie Midge. I'll add it to my backpack. Hi, Mall. Hi, Mom. Did you find any agate stones? Yep, they're in my backpack. Let's get them from my backpack. Wow, thanks for the agates, Molly. I'll polish these up so we can sell them at the trading post. How's it going, Molly? Hi, Dad. Did you find any blueberries? Yep, they're in my backpack. Let's get them from my backpack. Anabasi, thanks for the blueberries, Mall. Now I can make blueberry jam. How's it going, Molly? Hi, Auntie Midge. Did you find any sap for me? Yep, it's in my backpack. Let's get it from my backpack. Thanks, Molly. This sap will make delicious syrup we can have with pancakes. This is Mr. Patuk's wood shop. He's not here right now. This is the greenhouse where we grow vegetables and other plants. Nobody's in there now. Beading art. Hi, I'm Molly, and my mom is helping me learn how to bead. Beading is an important part of our culture. These are all my beading design cards. Design cards teach people how to make new things. Choose one of Molly's designs or make your own. Here are all my beading designs. My family and friends gave me many of these. Pick the design you'd like to make. Mountain flower. Butterfly. Wolf paw print. Leaves. Suki. 
Here's the design card you picked. Suki! Adorable! The card tells us the title of the design and a description. It also has the list of materials and the steps for beating our design. This design has seven steps. Let's get started. We should make sure we have everything we need. Read the materials list and tap all the items we'll be using. Materials Pencil Cloth Bead box Needles Thread Tap everything we need. Pencil That's on our list. Cloth That's on our list. Tape That's not on our list. Let's check the list again. Bead box That's on our list. Needles, that's on our list. Clothespin, that's not on our list. Let's check the list again. Red, great job. You looked at the list of materials and picked everything we need. Now let's read the steps we need to follow. Step 1. Trace the shape with the pencil. Tracing the shape tells us what the design looks like. Tap to trace the shape. Looks good. Step 2. Choose the gray beads. That's right! That's the color we need for this step. Let's go to the next step. Step 3. Stitch the gray beads until you're done. Step 4. Choose the white beads. That's not the right color. Let's look at the step again. Step 4. Choose the white beads. That's right! That's the color we need for this step. Let's go to the next step. Step 5. Stitch the white beads until you're done. Step 6. Choose the black beads. That's right! That's the color we need for this step. Let's go to the next step. Step 7. Stitch the black beads until you're done. Quincy! This design looks amazing! I think it would make a great gift. Pick something to put our design on. Shroomcha! Looks great! This will be a nice gift for one of my friends in Kaya. Choose one of Molly's designs or make your own. I can't wait to give this present to my friend Trini. She'll love what I beat it for her. I'll add it to my backpack. Deliver the present to Trini. Looks like the library is closed right now. Hi, Molly! Hey, Trini! I beaded something special just for you. It's in my backpack. Let's get it from my backpack. Wow! That's so nice of you. Thanks, Molly! Fish camp. Hey everyone, my dad taught me how to fish for food. Now I'm fishing with Trini and her dad, and I have a book to help us. Which way should we go for a fishing adventure? Let's catch lots of salmon to eat in the winter. Here's a book we can use. It's called Alaskan Fishing. There are a few fish wheels at fish camp that we can use. Which one has all the important parts? 
tap the book to open it. Hi, I'm here to help you while you play. Try tapping on me right now. Alaskan Fishing by Gil Neff. Here's the page of the book that can help us. Let's read the book to find out which wheel has all the parts it needs. Parts of a fish wheel. Fish wheels are a traditional form of fishing. Net. Net scoop the fish out of the water. Base. The base floats in the water and holds up the wheel. Trough. Troughs are boxes that catch the fish as they leave the nets. Tap the fish wheel with all of the important parts. That's not right. Let's look at the diagram to learn about parts of a fish wheel. Tap the fish wheel with all of the important parts. That's not right. Tap the fish wheel. Woohoo! You use the diagram to choose a fish wheel with the important parts. We're not ready to fish yet. Tap to put a snack into our bag. Great job! Let's fish! This is our fish wheel. It spins around in the water and catches fish in the net. After the net catches fish, the salmon come out of a slide. We need three full troughs of salmon. But which slide will the fish come down? Tap to move the trough to the side where they slide down to catch them. We caught a fish! We need more fish to fill our trough. Trap is full. It's time to fill another. It's full! Here's an empty one. That trap is full. Nice fishing! That's all that we need to catch today. We believe that we don't catch the salmon. The salmon give themselves to us. So we take only what we need. This salmon will be great to eat in the winter. Masi Cho, thank you to the salmon. That was fun. Let's keep going. Let's catch some salmon for dinner. I wonder where in the river we can find salmon. Tap the book to open it. Alaskan Fishing by Gil Neff. Here's the page of the book that can help us. Let's read the book to find out what part of the river will have lots of salmon. Middle of the river. The water moves faster in the middle of the river. Edges of the river. Salmon often swim here where the water isn't moving very fast. Tap to choose a part of the river to find fish. Nice! You use the diagram to choose the part of the river with lots of salmon. We're nearly ready to fish! Tap to put on our life jackets. Great job! Let's fish! Let's go fishing! We need three fish! Press and hold the arrows to raise and lower the lure. You can use your... We caught a salmon! Press and hold the arrow to bring it up to the boat. Hooray! We caught a fish! Only two more to go. We caught a salmon! Press and hold the arrow to bring it up to the boat. Woohoo! We caught another fish. We only need one more. We caught a salmon! Press and hold the arrow to bring it up to the boat. Great fishing! That's all that we need to catch today. This salmon was delicious. Masi Cho, thank you to the salmon. That was fun. Let's keep going. Let's catch some salmon for a celebration at the tribal hall. Where should we put our fish wheel to catch the salmon? Tap the book to open it. Alaskan Fishing by Gil Neff.
Here's the page of the book that can help us. Let's read the book to find out where we should put our fish wheel. Middle of the river. The water moves faster in the middle of the river. Edges of the river. Salmon often swim here where the water isn't moving very fast. Tap to choose a part of the river to find fish. Hooray! You use the diagram to choose where to put our fish wheel. We're almost ready to fish. Tap to match everyone with their boots. Great job! Let's fish! We caught a fish! We need more fish to fill our trough. Half is full. It's time to fill another. It's full. Here's an empty one. That chop is full. Great fishing. That's all that we need to catch today. Salmon was perfect for our celebration at the tribal hall. Masi Cho, thank you to the salmon. We finished our fishing adventure. Let's go on another one. Great fishing! We still have more chun salmon. Let's bring some to Tui so he can feed it to his sled dogs. I'll add the fish to my backpack. the fish to Tui. Hi, Molly. Hey, Tui. I just caught some really big fish. Now I have some extra fish in my backpack that you can feed to your dogs. Let's get it from my backpack. Whoa, awesome. My dogs love eating chump salmon. Oyana, that means thanks in the Yupik language. Bring the ball to the basketball hoop at school. Bring the drum to Grandpa Nat. Bring the dog treats to Suki. <coughs> Do you want some treats, Suki? I have some in my backpack. <coughs> Let's get them from my backpack. Throw the treats to Suki. <coughs> That's enough treats for Suki. This is where my friend Trini lives. Let's see if she's nearby. Hey, Molly. Hey, Trini. That snowball fight was fun. Want to have another? Meet me and Tui at the snow fort. Totally. Snowball fights are so much fun. Veggiezilla. Hi, everyone. It's me, Molly. And I'm Trini. Welcome to my garden. Vegetables need sunlight to grow, and in the summer, Alaska gets a lot of sunlight, so our veggies can get really big. Help us grow giant vegetables to eat. Maybe... Cabbage. Here are our cabbage plants. We're going to take care of them so they can grow really big for the fair. If you want to take a break or start over, tap this button. Oh no! 
The soil in our garden is getting too dry. What can we read to learn how to water our plants? Which of these will help us find out how to fix our soil? A book called Vegetable Recipes. A blog post called Garden Help, Problems with Soil. A seed packet called Tomato Seeds. A seed packet called Tomato Seeds. Hmm, that seed packet won't help us. It's about growing tomatoes. We need to find out about fixing dry soil. Great job! Nice! This informational blog post can help us learn how to fix our soil. Plants need lots of water. When soil gets dry, gardeners water their gardens with watering cans or hoses. What tools should we use to water our soil? Tap the soil to add water. Awesome! Our soil isn't dry anymore. And our plants are growing. Lindsay! We are ready for the fair. Let's see how much the cabbage weighs. We did it! Wow, that cabbage is enormous! And we won first place in the Alaska State Fair! I can't wait to share these yummy vegetables with our friends and family! Woohoo! Let's grow some more big vegetables! the greenhouse, where we grow vegetables and other plants. Nobody's in there now. What can you find at the lake? Tap the arrows to explore. Ooh, a fox! Look at those caribou! Aww, snow hares! Cool, an owl! Hi there, Molly! What can you find at the river? Tap the arrows to explore. You spotted a din jack! A moose! Ooh, a fox! That's a big salmon! Cool, an owl! Tap the basketball to shoot it into the hoop! Job. Awesome. Yeah. Woohoo. Awesome. Great job. 
吧。Job. Woohoo! Great job. Yeah. Great job! Woohoo! Woohoo! Great job! Great job! Yeah! This is the spooky house. It doesn't look like anyone's in there. Spooky. Let's have a snowball fight. Tap to throw snowballs at Trini and Chewie. And watch out.
Hi, Molly. Hi, Grandpa Nat. Your mom called and said the trading post is very busy. Can you go help her out? Sure. I love helping out at the trading post. Masicho. Thanks, Molly. I love sharing this tradition with you, Molly. Let's make some music. Hi, Mal. Hi, Mom. I'd love some more agate stones. Can you find any more at the river? Yeah, I'm on it. Masi, cha. How's it going, Molly? Hi, Dad. Can you pick me some fresh blueberries so I can make some more blueberry jam? I'd love to help. Anabasi, thanks, Molly. Collect some agate stones to bring to mom. All done. Here in Alaska, we only take what we need, and we've got five beautiful agate stones. Let's bring the agate stones to mom. I'll add them to my backpack. Pick blueberries so Dad can make blueberry jam. All done! Here in Alaska, we only take what we need, and we've got a full basket. Let's bring the blueberries to Dad. I'll add them to my backpack. How's it going, Molly? Hi, Dad. Did you find any blueberries? Yep, they're in my backpack. Let's get them from my backpack. Anna Bassi, thanks for the blueberries, Mal. Now I can make blueberry jam. How's it going, Mal? Hi, Mom. Did you find any agate stones? Yep. They're in my backpack. Let's get them from my backpack. Wow! Thanks for the agates, Molly. I'll polish these up so we can sell them at the trading post. Sled Dog Dash. Choose a sledding mission. Kantishna River. Hi, everyone. It's me, Molly. And I'm Tui. It's Grandpa Nat. We need to bring him a camera so he can take photos of fish and plants at the river. We can take my dogs on a sledding mission. Let's go. Our mission. Deliver the camera to Grandpa Nat. We need five dogs to pull our sled. Tap the dogs in their houses to pick them. Luca. Rascal. Laika. And so. Skippy, here's our dog team. Ready to go. Help me finish packing the gear we'll need for the trip. Put everything into the box. White jackets. Black jackets. Light up colors. A camera to deliver to Grandpa. Everything's packed. And I have my Sled Advisor app on my phone to help us.
Let's get started on our sledding adventure. Three, two, one, go! Here we go! You can steer the sled around the obstacles like dirt patches and rocks. Get the treats and toys for a speed boost. Woohoo! Extra speed! Look at us go! Awesome! We made it to the first checkpoint. Let's see how the dogs are doing. The weather is going to get very cold. Learn about gear dogs need to wear in cold weather. Let's check our app to find out what to do. Tap on the part of the app that tells where you can learn about gear for cold weather. Dog care. Dog gear. Sled. Tap me if you need help. Dog gear. That's right! You can learn about it in the dog gear part of the app. Tap on the part of the app that tells where you can learn about gear for cold weather. Cold weather gear. Warm weather gear. Night gear. Sled gear. Cold weather gear. That's right! You can learn about it in the cold weather gear part of the app. What should we use to keep the dog's bellies warm in cold weather? Cold weather gear. Black jackets. Black jackets keep dog's bellies warm in cold weather. Dog boots. Dog boots protect dog's feet from snow and water. Leggings. Leggings keep dog's legs warm when it is windy. What should we use to keep the dog's bellies warm in cold weather? Black jackets. Light-up collars. Dog boots. Black jackets. That's right. That's what the diagram says. Tap the dog to dress him in the jacket. Good job. Let's get back to the sled. We're one step closer to getting the camera to Grandpa. Three, two, one, go! kept the dogs warm while they were sledding. Our dogs can get hurt if their nails grow too long. Learn about what kind of care and grooming dogs need when their nails are too long. Let's check our app to find out what to do. Tap on the part of the app that tells where you can learn about what kind of care and grooming dogs need when their nails are too long. Dog care. Dog gear. Sled. Dog care. That's right! You can learn about it in the dog care part of the app. Tap on the part of the app that tells where you can learn about what kind of care and grooming dogs need when their nails are too long. Hungry sled dogs. Thirsty sled dogs. Rest. Grooming. Grooming. That's right! You can learn about it in the grooming part of the app. What tool should we use to cut the dog's nails? 
Grooming. Tool. How to use it. Nail clippers. Cut long nails so they don't hurt the dog. Lotion. Rub onto tired muscles to help them feel better. Brush. Remove loose hair and tangles. What tool should we use to cut the dog's nails? Lotion. Nail clippers. Leggings. Nail clippers. That's right. That's what the table says. Tap to clip the dog's nails, but be gentle. Good job. Let's get back to the sled. We're getting closer. Time for more sledding. Three, two, one, go! Our dogs are thirsty after running so far. Learn about how to take care of dogs when they're thirsty. Let's check our app to find out what to do. Tap on the part of the app that tells where you can learn how to take care of dogs when they're thirsty. Dog care. Dog gear. Sled. Dog care. That's right! You can learn about it in the dog care part of the app. Tap on the part of the app that tells where you can learn how to take care of dogs when they're thirsty. Hungry sled dogs. Thirsty sled dogs. Rest. Grooming. Thirsty sled dogs. That's right! You can learn about it in the thirsty sled dogs part of the app. What should we use to help us get water for the dogs? Thirsty sled dogs. Sled dogs need a lot of water to stay healthy, one and a half gallons a day. Water is heavy to carry, so when people are traveling far, they melt snow into water by heating it. Heating snow in a cooking pot melts the snow into water. What should we use to help us get water for the dogs? Dog boots. Meat. Cooking pot. Cooking pot. That's right. That's what the caption says. Splash the water to let the dogs know they can drink. Good job. Let's get back to the sled. This is our last sled run before we get to Grandpa. Three, two, one, go! The dogs had enough water to keep going the whole time. Yay! We did it! Here's the camera you asked for. Now I can take photos of all the fish and plants I found. Masi Cho Molly, how helpful. I couldn't have done it without help from my friends. Choose your next sledding mission. Hi, Molly. Hey, Tui. Want to have another snowball fight? Meet me and Trini at the snow fort. That sounds awesome. See you there. Hey there, 
there, Molly. How's it going? Hey, Trini. If you want, we can grow giant vegetables in my garden. Denali Trading Post. Hey everyone, it's me, Molly. Welcome to the Denali Trading Post. This is a busy store, and Suki and I could really use your help. Let's see who we can help first. Kenji is here with a shopping list. You're going dog sledding? We have just what you need. Let's see what's on your list. A headlamp. Tap the arrow to find it. Let's find the dog sledding gear. When you find it, tap or drag it into the basket. A headlamp. Woohoo! We found it! Have a great day, Kenji! It's time to help the next person. Hi, Oscar! Let's see what's on your list. Binoculars and a rope. Tap the arrow to find the... Let's find the camping gear. A rope. Binoculars. Yeah! We found everything! Thanks for stopping by, Oscar. Let's see who's next. Hi, Vera! Let's see what's on your list. Lotion and shampoo. Tap the... Let's find what they wanted. Lotion, shampoo. We did it! Have a great day, Vera! Let's put these things away. Drag each one to its empty spot. Now you put the rest away. Good job! We put everything away. Let's take a break and play with Suki. Tap on her ball to throw it. Tap on her stick to play tug of war. The training post is busy today. Hello, Mr. Patuk. Let's see what's on your list. A stuffed moose, a stuffed puffin, and a snow globe. Tap the arrow to find each thing. Let's find the toys. A stuffed puffin, a stuffed moose, a snow globe. Yeah, we found everything. Thanks for stopping by, Mr. Patuk. This place is hopping today, Suki. Hi, Jake. Let's see what's on your list. A lantern, a backpack, and a headlamp. Tap the arrow to find... Let's find the hiking gear. A lantern, a backpack, a headlamp. Woohoo! Have a great day, Jake. Let's see who's next. Hello, Connie. Let's see what's on your list. A rope, a life jacket, and a map. Tap the arrow to find each thing. Let's find the canoeing gear. A life jacket. A rope. A map. Yeah! We found everything! Have a great day, Connie! We have more things to put on the shelves. Awesome! We put everything where it needs to go. Let's get some fresh air with Suki. The training post is busy today. Hello, Atsuk. Let's see what's on your list. A mallet, a wrench, a drill, and a screwdriver. Tap the arrow to find each thing. Let's find the tools. A drill. A screwdriver. A mallet. A wrench. Woohoo! Masi Cho! Thanks, Atsuk. It's time to help the next person. Hi, Nina. Let's see what's on your list. A book called Fishing, a tackle box, a life jacket, and a fishing hat. Tap the arrow to find each thing. Let's find the fishing gear. A book called Fishing, a tackle box, a fishing hat, a life jacket. 
Yeah, we found everything. Masi Cho. Thanks, Nina. This place is hopping today, Tsuki. Hello, Kenji. Let's see what's on your list. Sunscreen, water shoes, a GPS device, and a map. Tap. Let's find the canoeing gear. Water shoes, a map, a GPS device, a tackle box. I don't think that was on the shopping list. Let's check the shopping. Let's find sunscreen. We did it. Have a great day, Kenji. We have more things to put on the shelves. Oops, we have to match each thing to its spot on the shelf. Good job. We put everything away. Hey, Suki. Let's play. How's it going, Molly? Hi, Auntie Midge. More people are asking for my famous syrup. Can you collect more sap for me? Sure thing. Mustn't Cho. Thanks, Molly. Hi, Molly. Hi, Dad. Can you pick me some fresh blueberries so I can make some more blueberry jam? I'd love to help. Anabasi. Thanks, Molly. Hi, Mal. Hi, Mom. I'd love some more agate stones. Can you find any more at the river? Yeah, I'm on it. Masi Cho. Thanks, Molly. Let's collect sap to bring to Auntie Midge so she can make her syrup. First, throw a hole in the tree. Next, put the spile, a small tube, into the tree. This is how the sap will flow out. Then, pound the spile in to get it just deep enough to stay in place. Now, hang the bucket to collect the sap. All done! Here in Alaska, we only take what we need, and we've got a full bucket. Let's bring the sap to Auntie Midge. I'll add it to my backpack. Let's pick blueberries so Dad can make blueberry jam. All done! Here in Alaska, we only take what we need, and we've got a full basket. Let's bring the blueberries to Dad. I'll add them to my backpack. Let's collect some agate stones to bring to Mom. All done! Here in Alaska, we only take what we need. And we've got five beautiful agate stones. Let's bring the agate stones to Mom. I'll add them to my backpack. That's where Tui is. That's where Trini is. That's where Suki is. That's where Grandpa Nat is. That's where Auntie Midge is. That's where Mom is. That's where Dad is. That's where I am. Hi, Molly. Hi, Auntie Midge. Did you find any sap for me? Yep, it's in my backpack. Let's get it from my backpack. Thanks, Molly. This sap will make delicious syrup we can have with pancakes.
How's it going, Molly? Hi, Dad. Did you find any blueberries? Yep, they're in my backpack. Let's get them from my backpack. Anna Basi, thanks for the blueberries, Mal. Now I can make blueberry jam. How's it going, Mal? Hi, Mom. Did you find any agate stones? Yep, they're in my backpack. Let's get them from my backpack. Wow! Thanks for the agates, Molly. I'll polish these up so we can sell them at the trading post. Hi, Molly. Hey, Dewey. Want to have another snowball fight? Meet me and Trini at the snow fort. That sounds awesome. See you there. Hey, Molly. Hey, Trini. That snowball fight was fun. Want to have another? Meet me and Tui at the snow fort. Totally. Snowball fights are so much fun. Do you want some treats, Suki? I have some in my backpack. Let's get them from my backpack. Throw the treats to Suki. That's enough treats for Suki.